Hello, Verify here. I'm going to show you how to download and install Megamod 9 for Banished. First thing we need to do is open your browser of choice. No browser shaming here. I'm using Chrome. <laughs> Use whichever one you wish. We need to go to blackliquidsoftware.com and from here we need to scroll down. Um, you can go into downloads and get a, a previous version. I'll just show you. You've got Megamod 8.01 and Colonial Charter if you uh, so choose. But we'll go back. Here we are. So we've got General Megamod Discussion. If we click that, we have Megamod 9 Public Beta. I'll post a link directly to this page down in the uh, in the description just to make life a little bit easier. You can also Google Megamod 9 and it should take you to this. One thing to note, this is a large file. So once we unzip the file, it is big nice <laughs> so make sure you definitely have space on whatever hard drive that um, banished is installed on so we'll scroll down to the bottom of this message from kral Jurg, and here we are megamod beta download currently we're at build 0202 but anyway so you're going to have an option here in a second to download you have to be really patient it does take a little minute or two uh, so we're going to click on download and then we're going to click download anyway now there's a possibility when I click this that it may say that too many people have downloaded recently and that you can't and that you have to wait. If that happens, I'll put another link down in the description for an alternate place to uh, get the uh, file from. As you can see, it's currently downloading. This will download into my downloads folder. I guess it depends whatever your default download location is. So now we need to unzip this folder and get the contents out. You can use whichever program you wish, Win, uh, WinZip, WinRAR. Uh, I think I've got 7-zip I have and I think there's one that comes built in with Windows. They should all work. Um, I'm just going to click open and as we can see we have all the files here. So I'm just going to put that there for a second. I'm going to grab Steam and I'm going to click on banished and then once I'm on here I'm going to right click. I'm going to go to manage and I'm going to go to browse local files. So once we have this open all mods go into this win data folder. What I'm going to do is just drag and highlight these, drag them and drop them in there. Perfect, job done. Now, if you have any other mods, they're potentially going to be in here too. But that's done. We can close this now. Um, just before I load up the game, I thought I'd just show this quickly. This is a list of all the mods that are included in Mega Mod 9 currently. Um, I'm not sure he's going to add anything else to it, but this is literally everything. You can get this from the Black Liquid software forum, the same place uh, where we initially clicked the download link. So if you really want to have a look, you can do. Um, next thing to do is to load up Banished. Now, I just thought I'd warn you, currently the game loaded up really quickly for me. But once we go into the, uh, the mod section here, we have all of uh, the Mega Mod 9 parts. We need to make sure that we enable every single one of them and keep them in order as well. Now, if you have any other mods, um, which you may want to keep, make sure that below the Mega Mod, because I think these, these are guaranteed at the moment to sort of work together. If you load something above them, it may conflict. Um, and you can use these arrows here to move them up and down. So we'll click OK. And what this will do is um, reload Banished with the Mega Mod active. Now, this may take a minute or two. I have quite a good machine. But that being said, it's still going to take a little bit of time, maybe a minute or two. So just be patient with it. It's not crashed. And it will do this every time you load the game. Later. And there we go. We're in. And just to check it's working, click mods. Everything's enabled. Perfect. Right, we're finally in. So now just to quickly check to see if it's actually all working fine. We click new. Straight away I can see because we have the CC here for Colonial Charter. And these are not something you'd get in the default game. Fantastic. It's all working. So go forth. Enjoy Mega Mod and the word of warning, there is a lot of stuff. I hope this video helped. Thank you for watching and until next time, as always, take care.